Friday night's clash between West Coast and North Melbourne promises to be a two-man show with Nick Natanui and Majak Dor heading the bill. And while Natanui has the runs on the board, his teammates have enjoyed a day of ribbing. Lockie Reid has the story. There is sure to be some Majak moments on Friday night, but will they reach the heights of the flying Fijian who owns the mantle of the AFL's human highlight reel? I can do this myself. Bang, off he went. Majak Dawes brief stint in the big time teasing footy fans. A six goal haul in just his sixth game providing this week's clash with plenty of excitement. The boys have been calling me Majak all day so I'm sick of hearing his name. <laughs> <laughs> the physical comparisons between the Eagles Ruckman and his Kangaroos counterpart obvious. Both boys incredibly athletic but there is one notable difference. Have you seen a bigger man? <laughs> That's probably the main thing I've been copying about in the gym. They're saying, you know, this guy looks like, yeah, and where's your muscles? Uh, <laughs> so I'm sure he's going he's gonna to probably scare a few guys out there when, he, when he's playing. Dor in form, but may find life a little tougher amongst West Coast defence, who will bravely stand in his path if need be. Uh, yeah, well, if, if we have to, yes, I will. Nat Nui happy to hand out tips to his rival. Nobody knows better how to handle the hype and the troubles that come with standing out in the crowd. You know, especially the kids who come to the games, they, they couldn't care less um, what you look like. Or uh, if you've got some funny looking dreads, they might take a bit more of a liking to you. But um, yeah, it's more about your ability on the field. So I just, you know, told him just to. Um, obviously reported if it does happen because, um, you know, we don't want that around. Victory important for both the Eagles and the Kangaroos who are desperately keen to stay in the top eight hunts. The Roos sweating on the fitness of captain Andrew Swallow who had scans on his knee. I'm really hopeful, but, yeah, I'm not going to know until late in the week. It's, you know, I won't run for the next couple of days. Lockie Reed, 10 News.